Hey everyone, welcome back. I have a little unboxing today. So cute. It's in this little bag. And I'm going to show you guys what it is. Okay, so I'm just using the shelves in my bedroom where I keep all my bags. So pretty. So here's the box. I just got it today. I have not um, unwrapped it yet because I have no idea how Louis Vuitton does their ribbons. It is gorgeous and I can never replicate it when I try to um, tie it back up again. So I'm just going to unbox it now. One-handed, which is slightly difficult. And this is a hard to get item. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Look how it's packaged. It's like the sunglasses that I got earlier this month. So cute. All right, let's see if I can do this with one hand. Sometimes these boxes are really, really tight. And this is a very hard to get item, only as of lately. I don't know why. I guess it's because Louis Vuitton started discontinuing. And oh my gosh, I did not know it came in this tiny little dust bag. That is so freaking cute. Look at that dust bag. Oh, and by the way, guys, the Louis Vuitton in um, Austin is incredible at the domain. It is the best. So I'm going to show you what it is. You probably already saw what it is just now. It is the Toiletry 15. I know this is like a terrible reveal. Hold on. Okay, I had to I had to like pry it out of the bag, but here we go. It's so cute. I wanted this size, this size and the 26. However, now I'm thinking that the 19, I believe it's the 19, would also be a really good size. Unfortunately, it's one of those sizes that is difficult to find. And I think they're discontinuing these, at least that's the word on the street, um, that they're discontinuing them. This is made in Spain. Sorry for my nails, they're kind of hideous. But um, it is so cute and I'm just gonna open it up now. This is the interior. Tags. Textile and the number, just put that there. And then this is what it looks like on the inside. The bottom. And this is compared like next to the mini, uh, the Chanel mini denim. So that's what it looks like right in front of it. There you go. And this is what it looks like in front of my cocoa handle in the mini size. I guess they're calling it the small now. Right there. I'm not sure if it'll fit inside, but it looks like it will, which is so awesome. I'm so excited to put this inside of my cocoa handle. And this is what it looks like next to my Neverfull from the Game On collection. And then next to my boy bag. So it is the perfect size to be like a catch haul in tiny bags. And this is my new Tip Baker bag. I just feel like it matches so, so well with all of the bags that I have. Here we go, I can also put it in there and I can put it in my Chanel backpack. I know everything's kind of cramped together, but just wanted to give you guys kind of like a size reference. And that's it. I love the dust bag. And I think this size is perfect. So thank you so much for watching my video. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and it helped you a little bit in understanding what kind of bags it will fit in. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. See you next time. Bye. Okay, I just really want to see, and this is like an outtake. I just really want to see if this fits in my cocoa handle. Up a little bit and this is going to be a little bit tricky with one hand but I'm going to try to do it. Unfortunately it is not fit in my mini cocoa handle. Uh, it is way too tight so if you want to put something like this in your cocoa handle it's going to have to be more of like um, a pouch or a coin purse or I don't know, some smaller type of SLG with rounded corners. These square corners are not 
not helping it at all, but I'm pretty sure that it will fit into the boy bag. Let's try putting it into the boy bag. Okay, so I just got my boy bag down here and I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this one handed, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna fit in here. All right, so I did fit it in there, but it's pretty much the only thing that will fit in there. You can see that it's not, it's not gonna fit too much more. So I probably wouldn't use it in my boy bag either, but it will 100% fit into my bum bag, which is still exciting because I am crazy about the bum bag. I wear it all the time. And that's just really practical to have this little catch-all inside of my bum bag. Still pretty stoked about that. Woo!